guys, what is going on? Jonathan here from TSP98. So guys, if you haven't already seen my video or the video that will be coming out in the next couple of hours, be tuned for that because it tells you a little bit about myself, about the channel, giveaways, what you guys want to see, and I also added a new segment to the channel. But without further ado, let's carry on with the unboxing of the R4 Bulldozer case. So this is a very industrial looking case, and as we get through all the packaging, and all the boring user manuals and stuff we actually find the side panel of the case and of course the computer case itself so i've said this many times but it is a very industrial looking case and as you guys already know i like to do voiceover videos so i'm actually voice this video over it's just for my brother so it's not really anything important put a core two quarter baby graphics card he's only five so he doesn't need anything big we have two usb 2.0 audio in audio out as well as a rubberized power button and a reset button so we also have a 94mm fan, which is blue or red LEDs, depending on what you guys want. On the front, we have our temperature indicator, so it tells you a little bit about the temperature. R4 bulldozer powerful PC cooling case, so it's very good. This is my favorite feature of the case. It's where the, the card ejects, or I should say it's SIM, SIM reader, disk reader. I don't know what's going on with me today. Anyway guys, as you guys can see, we have two USB 2.0 as I said, and the rubberized power and reset switch. So that's a quick panoram of the outside of the case. So it's a very good looking case, I'll give it that. It's very industrial, very robustic. It's, I love this case a lot. It just, it's made to be a gaming case. It's an ITX or an ATX case, so really doesn't matter. The only downside I have with it, it supports only two hard drives. So I don't really use this as my main case. Again, I gave it to my five-year-old brother because I have like, I don't know, like four terabytes in my PC, including an SSD, which is new. I don't really make a video on it, but anyway, we'll remove the plastic over the indicators. And as we can see, it's a very good looking case. If we slide down the back panel, or the side panel, I should say, we have the case, of course. We have some of the inner components, such as the fan. We got some packaging we have to get through. And of course, on the bottom, we have our USB headers and our power switch and the LED switch and all of that good stuff. So I did end up connecting this, by the way, that is Molux or Molex. Uh, so I did end up connect connecting this like 20 minutes after the video. It only took like 15 minutes to build, so it was an easy job. Anyway, here we have some of the inner screws and shields and all of that good stuff. It also comes with a speaker, which I'm actually using right now in it. And there is where the two hard drives go, so nothing really special. Here is a quick pan around of the case, as you guys can already see that. It is a pretty good looking case, and it does take 35 millimeter screws, I believe. Anyway, here are some of the volume fan speed up controls, as well as two LED indicators for you guys right there and that's pretty much it for this video so don't forget to hit the thumbs up button subscribe and check out my other content